Hey horse friends, I'm Becca Salamone and this is Southern Horse Talk. I am coming to you from the Alabama Horse Fair in, at Garrett Coliseum in Montgomery, Alabama. It's a two day fair and it's Sunday, March 6th, so come on out if you can. And I am sitting here with a friend, a lifelong friend, Libby Shackelford. She's the founder and owner of Carousel of Breeds in Montevallo, Alabama. How are you doing today, Libby? I'm good, I'm good. And she, the sunshine. Yes, it's nice and warm out here. And you also have the rodeo royalty booth at the fair, so tell us a little bit about that and how that got started. Well, we're trying to promote the past queens and the rodeo title holders, and you can get your picture made with a queen. Um, we've got little crowns we're giving to the princesses, and we've got a bunch of information on all the contests coming up, Morgan County Rodeo, Limestone, Little Boots. Um, we've got uh, experts in modeling, horsemanship, interview, um, modeling what did I say modeling already but all the things you need to know to be a rodeo queen yeah and, and Sylvie Daggett came by yesterday in an interview with us she's the uh, 2014 Little Boots Rodeo Queen and she came through your program is that right that's right that's right we've had four queens come through our program that's awesome so that makes you a bit of an expert yeah. so tell us a little bit more about Carousel of Breeds and what you teach there um, we start a lot of beginner riders and uh, as long as they can read, we start them. And then I have the oldest student is 80. I had an 80-year-old ride one time. But uh, mainly beginner riders in all disciplines and teach them horsemanship. Pick the feet, brush, um, take care of their horse, walk them out before they go galloping off. And um, we use a lot of the safety measures of the 4-H helmets and um, proper attire and that's all I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well you know a lot and you're also the leader of the Shelby County 4-H Horse Club, is that right? 18 years I've been the volunteer leader for Shelby County 4-H and we've got a great group of kids now. Um, had a lot come and go and uh, right now they're going to uh, build a bridge at Oak Mountain State Park next Saturday. Um, they're going to help the Backcountry Horsemen Association build a bridge up at Oak Mountain by the lake. That's awesome. They got the, the grant to do that. That's a, a wonderful thing that they're doing there. So what's one of your favorite things about working with kids and horses? I like to see that, that light bulb click in their head when they figure out how to pick up the correct lead, um, what they need to do to stop, uh, that, that light bulb moment. And everybody all over the state knows you as Miss Libby, and you have your Miss Libbyism. So, what's what's one of your fam famous sayings that you say? Uh, you move slower than my grandma. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you have anything else you want to share from the Alabama Horse Fair this year? Um, it was a great fair, and um, Western dressage is is a new and upcoming thing, and. I'm secretary of the Birmingham Dressage Combined Train Association, and we're really promoting Western Dressage. So with Lynn Palm here, and it's becoming aware, we've got a lot of local shows. Awesome. So where can folks go to find more information about you and Carousel of Breeds? It's carouselofbreeds.com or Facebook, Libby Shackleford, or Carousel of Breeds. Awesome. Well, thanks for sharing today at the Alabama Horse Fair. Okay. And viewers, you can go to the Southern Horse Talk Facebook group, join the conversation, share your horse story, your pics, and your videos, and help us share the Southern equine lifestyle.